Thomas the Silly Jr. here, aka Mustache Chum, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, aka Pokemon Gangster Squad. So you're probably wondering, hey, Mustache Chum, why are you in a lava location all of a sudden? Well, it turns out that I recorded the previous session, thinking, hey, I'm recording this session, and turned out, I was not recording my volume, so I went through the entire thing thinking, oh, I did this just fine, and then I looked it over and I was like, oh no, the volume is not working. So I tried to re-record over my session with stuff of me talking, so I was like, oh, I'll just go through it again, and I tried to listen to it. And then it turns out that the my volume still wasn't working apparently. So I was like, I'll delete both files. Only to find out that the volume probably might have worked if I just put my headset on. So that second recording probably would have worked. So I lost both of those. And now I've magically skipped ahead from the ice place. So I'll go over everything I went through, which wasn't much, by the way, as far as communication is concerned. I went through, as I said, the ice place. I died a few times. I believe the count was three. Uh, now, unfortunately, you probably missed the best bubble in the world, which makes me want to kill myself for missing that opportunity. Uh, I talked about the movie I reviewed, which was the S Belmont Experiment, I believe it was called. Pretty man movie. Uh, I talked about more fan fiction between how I wanted to structure my chapters. Like I said in episode 10, I wanted Squirtle and Pikachu to be together, like to hook up. Male, male, homosexual couple have... You know, I was talking about that again, which shouldn't surprise anybody. I was talking about what type of character archetypes it would be, which would be, um, you know, Squirtle would be the confident type, but more confident in the facility of character interactions. Like, he has confidence in making friends. He's decent at battle. And Charmander would be the girl that's all super confident. And she actually kicks butt, the most butt out of the three. And I said Pikachu would be the novice of the three, and he would be the most like, oh, since I got this head head or neck bandana, we can talk now because I'd be the catalyst for them to talk for whatever reason. I decided in my fan fiction that I never started writing anyway. I was like, oh yeah. Uh, he would be the most nervous of the three. Like, oh, I don't know if we can do this, guys. And then, you know, start to believe in himself as they went along. And then I added, oh, what if Cyndaquil were in the story? Well, he'd be the super tired, shy guy that probably hooks up with Cinda uh, sorry, with uh, Charmander. And, you know, have her be like, get that Sundere attitude toward him specifically. And then I talked about who I would want to be the final or one of the biggest protagonists of the show. Or the fan fiction. I thought Mewtwo would be that character for now. Maybe someone else. I don't know. Anyways, I talked about the stuff I was going through. And then I read the dialogue of the characters, which 
you is completely cut out now. Uh, and I think that was about it besides me dying. Oh yeah, I talked about my book because I was talking about how much of a failure I've been at everything in my life. Uh, you know, I published my book after several edits only to find out, well not edits, I should say rewrites. Uh, because I originally wrote my paper, uh, my book on paperback and I was like, I need to put this on a computer. So I rewrote it on the laptop word for word and then I rewrote it again in high school thinking oh man my old stuff is kind of garbage but I never edited, edited anything I kept moving forward and I kept driving the story forward so by the time I pu actually published the book which I probably too did too early and I went th probably through the wrong company because they sell the book super expensive, like $20 for a book, no thank you. I would cut that price in half, but I wasn't allowed to say, hey, cut that price in half. Of course not. So, there's that. Uh, and I was like, man, I'm also a failure on YouTube so far. I mean, I can't even hit up 100 subscribers, and I was thinking about doing something kind of embarrassing soon, maybe. I mean, I am reaching my 500 video, I think it is, about at this point. Um, so yeah, there's that. Uh, the failure of Syndicate X and, you know, wanting new superheroes to rise, that whole gimmick. Uh, you know, like, I'm terrified because I don't know what I'm really good at. Like, I've tried writing and I felt like I was really good at that, but then I, then no one picked up the book and... I mean, I guess no one would want to since, you know, all the screw-ups I made. But, um, I've been a failure at YouTube, and I don't, like, I, I'm not really that good at anything else. Like, I don't find, I don't see myself being that good at anything else. Everything where I am, it seems like the, the qualifications are way over something that I can be good at. Anyways, I'm going to advance. I apologize for taking up six minutes of your time and six minutes of my own life thinking, oh, I'm recording an episode, only to find out that I'm not recording an episode. Oh, man, that made me want to kill myself. For real, really reals. And like I said, you missed probably one of the best bubbles in history. Uh... Killed a rabidash in one hit, but you'll never see it on screen. New move. Okay. Bite. Let's get rid of Tail Whip, shall we? Yeah, because that move is useful. Yeah, leveled. So, you may be wondering what happened to the first recording. Well, like I said, it didn't even have the volume of my voice. What it had was... Oh, dear... Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. What it had was the sound of just the uh, sound of the music and the game sounds. So that's all that you could hear. So, like I said, I tried to re record over it, didn't think it came through. Then I deleted both files, thinking, oh, that didn't turn out good. And it turns out I was just being stupid and. My stupidity has caused... Well, it's not like anyone's watching these. Because, I mean, maybe like one or two or maybe, if I'm lucky, ten people at most. Oh, well. Very repetitive of what I've been used to is seeing myself die and then that happening. I died like three times, as I mentioned. Hmm. We almost made it. Yeah, right. Stop lying, Squirtle. We weren't even close. You know it. To be true, believe it, Naruto style. Um, boy, oh boy. Yeah, I was talking about how the Belko experiment was like. Oh, Jeebus! That kind of that almost took me completely off guard. I said how that movie was kind of mediocre, and I actually mentioned this in the review. Is uh, you feel like it has a very similar issue to the movie it was trying to be like, which is Battle Royale. Which I said, like, the main characters feel like they're more empty slates to insert yourself into the story. But what makes Battle Royale better than the Belko experiment is the characters surrounding the main character are actually a little bit more interesting. 
They're a little bit more over the top, sure, but I mean, that's what makes them stick out in that kind of scenario. And, you know, the boss characters who they're who are the protagonists aren't that interesting. So that's just, that was kind of a shame that not even the main protagonist could be good because that's usually the case for these types of movies where the death and not even the deaths were all that interesting. Most of them were just head explosions. And now I'm talking about that movie again. Oh boy. So, here goes another 30 minutes of me talking. And hopefully this video comes out okay. God forbid I have to do like another t attempt of recording over what I recorded. And then deleting both files. And then going through the rest of the game, not even doing a Let's Play anymore at this point. I just lose all control of what I'm doing at that point. And then I go, what is my life? If not but this. I mean, look, I have nothing else going on. Everything I can do is so limited. Like, like I said, I'm a writer. I like to do video game stuff, but all the video game stuff is in, you know, another state, for the most part. And doing a homemade video game, that, that, oh, oh boy. So, I'm noticing a pattern here, from the previous, uh, location. I died, like, three times, and I have dived twice here. So, at least, that... At least you're seeing what you kind of saw, what you would have saw, except the dialogue, which I'm sure you, I'm pretty sure if you've seen other Let's Players do this, when and you've seen more popular YouTubers do this a way back ago, like Riz Grace Star, for example, random shout out of the day. Jesus Christ, that Fury attack is insane. That's gotta be like the one of the worst attacks I've seen as far as damage is concerned. Like he could have killed me right there. I don't know, maybe the game lucked me out, I guess. I really hope that this is coming out okay, because now I'm starting to doubt myself and redoubt all of my future recordings, which sucks. Because now I'm going to have to look at each one and be like, oh, did I record it? Oh, boy. And I was, like, really getting on the whole I'll never reach 100 subscriber thing. Because the Black Critic guy said, oh, and random shout out to Black Critic guy, I guess, since I mentioned him right now. What is that burning status? That is not looking good. <laughs> Does that stay on? Woo! Level 19. Quick attack. Hmm. Uh. Leer was. Not useful to me, I think. Smokescreen was the. Don't move thing. So I think I'll forget Leer. Alright. Oh boy. Oh boy. I'm pleased to be killing this. Oh. Oh boy. Now Rex is probably going to die. Oh no. Oh. So much for that. Oh wow. Is this it? Is this Mount Blaze's summit? This is an incredible place. I know this is a, a volcano, but the amount of lava is way more than usual. This might also be part of the natural disasters. <laughs> Youch! It's wicked hot! I feel like I'm burning up, up, up. I don't want to be in this place this wickedly bad. Let's get through here quick. Halt! What? What the? Why did it turn black? Dark all like that? I can hear the mountain screams. It is shrieking in pain. 
Someone is causing Moan to Blaze to writhe in agony. Is it you? Huh? We don't know what you mean. We're not doing anything. We're just... We just happen to be traveling through here. Who are you anyway? Come out! Gah! The mountain rage is my rage. What are we facing like? Oh boy. What are we facing? Um, what's his face? Raiden from Metal Gear. I am Moltros, the warrior of fire I am. What is this, persona? Thou art I. I art thou. Jeez, the references in... Shoutouts today are off the charts. There is no forgiving those who befoul the mountain. Unguard! Alright, let's, uh, throw a rock. I believe he's right in front of me, so we're gonna do smokescreen. Yep, the whiffer effect. Let's try the quick attack, shall we? Let's see what that's all about. Oh. Huh. I imagine he's gonna absorb the ember, so... Uh-oh. <gasps> well, I have nothing else, so... Meh. What is that? Or blue, yeah, bubble. I mean, water gun. Pfft, bubble. Oh boy. Oh. Oh. Well, there's that. We died to the boss. Okay, I'm gonna say that this is a major flaw with the game, is that I'm able to save and store things here, but I cannot go back to town, so I cannot buy things, so I am essentially screwed at this boss, which was actually almost the thing last time, so this is very reminiscent of the previous non-existing episode that is no longer with us. Rip that episode, I suppose. Anyway, another 30 minutes or so of an uh, episode gone by that you'll never see on this Let's Play. Not that, like I said, I probably said this and I'll say it again. Not that a lot of people watch this. Probably 1 to 10 people. If I'm lucky, I'll get 10. And I'll never receive comments. I feel so lonely on the comment section. <laughs> Oh boy. So if you want to see a better Let's Player than me, then like I said, check out Riz Gristar. And if you want to see a better reviewer than me, then check out the Black Critic guy. There's my proper shoutout, double shoutout to two YouTubers that have it bigger than me. Why am I big? Why? Why? <laughs> like, I really love promoting new YouTubers, but man, oh man, are they hard to find. Ah, uh, YouTube. It never ceases to amaze me how much failure it can obtain in, in within a year. Within a year! 2016 was a terrible year for YouTube, and 2017 looks like it's going to be an, a follow-up to that disaster, potentially. So that is what I think of YouTube so far, 2017. It's still early, but my god, are we going through a rough patch early this year? for YouTube. Whoops. Oh boy. This has been a wonderful uh, experience. A bubble! Oh, it missed. Gosh darn it, Squirtle, why can't you be cool like you were that one time that we'll never get to see? Mmm. Uh. They say both of the things that I love to do, which is let's play and review, are cluttered. 
my goodness, is that not only true, but my god, it makes it so pe it's impossible for people to find someone like me. But I'm going to keep going until I commit suicide when I'm a hobo. Because I'll probably be a hobo. I mean, like I said, all the jobs I try to attempt to find require a car. I don't have a driver's license. Oh, wow, I actually got back up here pretty quick. Maybe he isn't round. Let's see if we can sneak through. That ain't happening. That not happen. You again? There is no forgiving those who torment the mountain. Ooga booga booga. You've got us wrong. We've just... Your words are meaningless. On guard. Again. Uh... Let's throw a rock. Uh... <laughs> yeah, Squirtle, you... Can I, like, set his move so that he's constantly doing that? Uh, let's see. Team. You. Moves. Um. Aha. Let's make sure you are doing either Bite or Water Gun. I feel like those will be super effective for this battle. Uh, and for me, I'll go with a quick attack. Status removed, oh boy. Double speed, oh boy. He pretty much almost killed Squirtle, oh boy. Let's throw that back on you, oh boy. Is unaffected, oh yeah. Bobble! You keep going with the bubble, Squirtle. I'll throw another smoke screen. Does... Oh. Bobble! Oh, dust. Gosh darn it. Smoke screen. Please kill him this time. Oh no! Squirtle! <laughs> God, this is the worst. This is the worst it's ever been. It's, oh man, this guy is owning us. I am really hating this. This is a bad episode, and it's worse than, I think it's worse than the prior episode, too. The one that doesn't exist, that being. Oh boy, look at, look at the camaraderie we have over here. Oops. Oh, Ember does work on that guy. Okay. I'll keep that in mind. Ember works on the bird. The bird is the word. Oh god, I really just said that. Oh god! Woo! And I believe this guy absorbs the fire. All right. Oh no. Oh. So is that only three attacks, or is that can that actually be more? I don't know. I wish someone would comment and let me know, but I don't think anyone will ever find this video. Red gummy. I suppose I'll just eat that. <sighs> what a disaster. What 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 did I do to myself to deserve this today? It's probably cuz I said I'm going to record on a day where I'm not at my top game. Oh. Uh I'm so like angsty about what floor he's on now. Bobble! Yeah. Bobble! Uh, money. I forgot if there was like a way to like... I forgot what buttons it was to do that thing where like you like stall in a single location. 
Uh, I don't know what the buttons are for that. Sorry if I am unknowledged in that department. So I'll walk around. I don't know what... <clears throat> I don't know what floor this guy is on, so... I'll wait until I'm, like, at 60 health. I think that ought to be good enough. Since this guy's gonna be super tough anyway. And no one's coming. You know what? I'll just wait until I get full health, so... Just in case. Alright, let's go. Yeah, it is floor 3. You blah blah blah. What a what a beautiful episode. And you've got us wrong. <sighs> Throw a gravlock. Eh. I'm gonna run out of those now. You just watch as I run out of that. Slowly but surely. Quick attack. I met like I imagine he's gonna absorb my fire, so Oops. Ugh, and that damage is so intense. He almost killed me in one attack. Yeah, this battle really depends on if I can keep both of us alive long enough for Squirtle to kill him. Hopefully, or if I get really lucky and my hit somehow makes it the one to be the one that hit that kills him. Jeez, I almost blah. Dang it, Squirtle! Uh oh. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. He's gonna die again. Do that. Come on, water gun. Ooh. Uh oh. What's this? How did he get out so fast? Bobble! It's not over yet. Oh. Oh boy, I'm on a smoke screen. Dang it, I missed! Yes! Oh! Woo! Ugh. I'm not done. I'm not finished yet. Wait, hold it. We didn't come to cause any trouble. We came here because we, we, we were chased here. And listen, this mountain isn't the only place that is suffering. Natural disasters are breaking all over the place. We can't do anything to help because we're on the run now. But we want to help Pokemon that are suffering from these natural disasters. Ellipses. Do you say that sincerely? I'm not lying to you. Believe me. Believe it! I know. I gotta believe. If you're thinking I'm lying... Oh, that's what I was gonna say. I was gonna say I was gonna rewatch Digimon World, uh, Digimon Season 3, even though it's the angsty teen poke, uh, Digimon season. I was like, that ending was really good. If you think I'm lying, look at my eyes. My sexual eyes. I pose my eyes in a seductive way. Ooh. Hmm. 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 Yeah. Ay 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 ay! What is this Power Rangers reference, baby? Hmm. Fine. I trust that you aren't lying. <laughs> Phew! That was rough. I thought I would kill over. You may pass. Get through Mount Blaze, and promise me this. Promise me that you will find the cause of the calamities and rack our, that rack our world and stop the disasters from sow, sowing more destruction and suffering. Alright, I promise. Of course we can't get to that right away, but... Gah! 
Whoa, whoa, whoa! We'll get to it right away! We're fugitives, so we can't get to it right away. <laughs> uh, that was, that was kind of funny. But we're a rescue team. We'll get to the bottom of this of what's causing these, the natural disasters. I promise. Believe it. Hmm. I will hold you to that promise. You've made me believe that you will honor that promise. If you do not forget that courage you showed in facing me. Gah! Wah! Is, is there anything else? No. I was only preparing to take off. Ah. Uh, does he need to do that? Farewell. Kaka! The bird is Dontron. Whoa. Aw, oh, sheesh, that was scary. But I'm glad Moltrus understood us, really. So anyway, we should get off Mount Blaze ourselves. And off to see the wizard. We go. Gasp, gasp. We've done a lot of walking. I'm beat. Let's get some rest. Ha! <laughs> The view's great here. Oh, hey, Zeke. You have to see this. I can see it. Look at that. See how small Mount Blaze looks? We sure came a long way. Hmm. Hey, Zeke. You remember how tough it was getting over Mount Blaze, right? Yeah. I died like four times. I don't think many Pokemon can get through here. And after that, we really went at it hard to get here. You know what I really think? Maybe there aren't any po more Pokemon that can chase us all the way here. Oh, uh, let's 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 lay it low for now. I knew it. I knew you'd say the two Zeke. Yeah, you're right. They can't be any. They can't be anyone else. <laughs> Ah, all right, we can say goodbye to living like fugitives. We we don't have to keep running away anymore. Ha 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 ha! Oh, this is no good, Zeke. We forgot about we forgot about some tough customers. Alakazam, his team won't drop the chase ever. Oh. We're not out of this yet. Let's get going. But we are true thugs. Even if we even if we face defeat over and over again, we keep on rocking, baby. We better go somewhere. No more nobody can get to. That'd be best. Let's knuckle down and keep going. Huh? What's the matter? Aren't you coming, Zeke? I feel like I'm at home. And you're making me leave? Hmm? What? Aren't you tired, you're asking? Oh, aren't I tired, Ty? We're being chased, we can't rest. And, I told you, didn't I? I said I'd go with you, Zeke. Don't look that way at me. I'm good, I'm good. Let's roll, Zeke. I'll go with you wherever you go. Play the Titanic theme song right there, baby. And so, Zeke's harrowing journey continued, seeking refuge in even harsher places. They fled north. They crossed row upon row of mountains, forded fitted swamps, scaled frozen cliffs, till finally Zeke's tiny team arrived in a world of snow. A frigid wasteland of driving blizzards. <clears throat> yes, let's save it, and hopefully this recording ends up okay. Save completo. Brr, it's cold. At two. Yuck, my nose is running and it's freezing. Hmm. This is one barren place. The snow's deep. 
There haven't been any Pokemon around for a while, either. Maybe there isn't any more... anyone else out here but us. Huh? What's up? Uh. What? What's that? It's a doggo. Hmm? What was that? It looked, it looked like a Pokemon, but... Was I seeing things? No, that can't be right. I'm sure there was someone there. I wonder what they were doing in a lonely place. Well, thinking about it isn't going to help. Let's keep moving. Looks like we're going to get a friendo. Wow! Zeke, check that out. See that? These, those trees are frozen. Lovely. Now we've gone into reverse Undertale. Now we're going through Snowden. Wow! The snow is like frozen powder. It looks pretty, but... It must be harsh there. So, we do have to get through this, huh? It's gonna be awfully cold, but it's not anywhere I really want to go. But there's no point in sticking around here forever. We can only go forward. We'll just have to go for it and get through to seek. Alright, let's save. And I'll call it here, and hopefully things turn out okay for the future. My name is Tom Sicily Jr., a.k.a. Mustache Sham, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!